Assalamualaikum and welcome to the next uh, video of arithmetic progressions. In last few classes, we have been uh, learning how to find the sum of first n terms of an AP. We'll continue with some more problems today. The question here on the board is 1 by 15, 1 by 12, 1 by 10, up to 11 terms. So, I will find the value of A first, which is 1 by 15. The value of D is A2 minus A1. A2 is 1 by 12, minus A1 is 1 by 15. You can take LCM or you can also cross multiply. So, 15 ones are 15, minus 12 ones are 12. Divided by 12, 15 is 180. So, 15 minus 12 is 3 divided by 180. And 3 ones are 3, 3 6 are 18 and 0 as it is. So, the value of D will be equal to 1 by 60. And the value of N is going to be 11 because you are supposed to find the sum of 11 terms. So, let us make use of the formula Sn is equal to n by 2 into 2a plus n minus 1 into d. S11 is equal to 11 by 2. 2 into a will be 1 by 15 plus n. n is 11 minus 1 and d. d is 1 by 60. So, 11 by 2 into 2 by 15 because 2 ones are 2 plus 11 minus 1 is 10 into 1 by 60. Now 11 by 2 into 2 by 15 plus 10 ones are 10, 10 6 are 60 can be cancelled. So you get 1 by 6. Next you have 11 by 2. You can now again cross multiply if you want. 2 6 are 12 plus 15 ones are 15 divided by 15 6 are 5, 6 are 30, 90. 15, 6 are is 90. So now 11 by 2 into 12 plus 15 is 17 by 90. Next, uh, what I want you to do is, I want to continue the problem from here. Multiply 11 into 17, get the answer. Then 2, uh, multiply with 90 and get the answer. Then divide, uh, simplify it with some table. And tell me what final answer you will get after simplification. So what I want to do is multiply 11 into 17, then 2 into 90 and then cancel it with some common table, uh, common multiples that you get in the table and then tell me what is going to be the final answer after simplification. Uh, based on the same table, I would like to give you one question as homework. Uh, so please do try this one. So you can try with 1 by 2, 1 by 7, 1 by 12, up to 10 terms. I want you to try this question as homework uh, and then tell me what answer you will get after simplification of that question and uh, do ask your doubts in the Google Classroom app. Thank you.